sad news for the NBA and Turner Sports. Turner Sports reporter and NBA reporter, writer. Basically, he had his own podcast. He, he's a very big personality when it comes to the NBA. Sekou Smith died at the age of 48 due to COVID-19. Um, he was an NBA reporter. He started as a beat writer covering the Pacers for the Indianapolis Star. And he covered the Hawks for the Atlanta Journal Constitutional. For over a decade, he was working for Turner Platform, served as an analyst for NBA, an NBA.com writer, and, he, and a host of Hang Time podcasts. And the source for this was Tim Bontem, so he's an ESPN staff writer. Um, before we end up giving any condolences or anything like that, before we end up talking about his career, I just want to give a moment of silence. Thank you. Um, first of all, I mean, let's be honest here. I mean, obviously, COVID-19 has touched so many of us. It's touched millions of people around the world. If Even people who weren't infected by it, obviously, everybody around the world, they got to wear masks and they got to do all these things to make sure that they don't spread the, the virus around. But I mean, the diet age 48, I just feel like that's really, that's too soon, you know, for anybody. And I mean, Sekou Smith, he was obviously a very loyal guy to Turner Sports. I mean, he's been working with them for over a decade. He's had a lot of experience in the NBA as a reporter, as an analyst. He was a very smart guy. Um, it's just something you don't really want to hear. You know what I'm saying? Like, especially with a guy this young who has, like, again, even though he's done, he's done a decent amount of things it w involving the NBA, he could have done so much more because he had that much life to live on. But again, COVID-19, it hits us all in a different way. And I mean, the only thing I can really say right now is condolences to his family and his friends, condolences to the NBA, and may Sekou Smith rest in peace. Your thoughts, no more? Uh, yeah, condolences go out to his family and the NBA. This is a very sad time for those people. Um, and the best of luck to his family in their future. And that's pretty much all I have to say about that. Right. And I mean, before we get off this topic, um, Adam Silver, the commissioner of the NBA, he did he did make a statement, and I quote, he said, the NBA mourns the passing of Sekou Smith, a beloved member of the NBA family. Sekou was one of the most affable and dedicated reporters in the NBA and a terrific friend in so many across the league. He covered a game for more than two decades, including the past 11 years with Turner Sports, where he showed his full range of skills as an engaging television analyst, pod podcast host, and writer. Sekou's, uh, Sekou's love for basketball was clear to everyone who knew him, and it all, always shined through in his work. Our heartfelt condolences to his wife, Heather, and their children, Gabriel, Riley, and Cameron. And um, um, I'm going to another quote. This is by Turner Sport. This is by Turner. He said, we are all heartbroken over uh, Sekou tragic passing. His commitment to journalism and basketball community was immense. And we will miss his warm, engaging personality. Turner Sports said in the statement, uh, he was beloved by his Turner Sports and NBA friends and colleagues. Our deepest condolences are with his family and loved ones. So, I mean, just those two quotes right there from the commissioner of the NBA and Turner Sports, who he's worked with, showed you how loyal he was to, the, to Turner Sports and the NBA. It showed you how dedicated he was to his job. It showed you how much respect a lot of people had for him. And there's obviously a lot more quotes to go on. But I felt like the commissioner and Turner Sports were the two most important ones I had to read off. And again, like obviously the whole NBA was touched when um, Craig Sager died. Craig Sager was a huge reporter in the NBA. Um, then uh, then there was uh, Stuart Scott, I believe. He when he died, everybody everybody basically, you know, that was another one that really touched everybody. And I want to say that, and I want to say that. Um, excuse me, Saku Smith, I want to say he had that, he could have had that same exact impact, but regardless, he still had a huge impact on the NBA in terms of sports. And for that, again, the only thing we can end it, end with is may he rest in peace and condolences to his loved ones and family. Anything else you want to add, Omar? No, oh, you pretty much summed it all up for me. Again, condolences to his family and the NBA, and best of luck to you guys in the future. May he rest in peace.